hoping that like shit goes down because I'm here for it. <laughs>here with my most anticipated reads for April 2018. I have a total of five books that I chose for this month. I tried to pick not so popular ones. There is one popular one because I'm just super excited about it so it has to be mentioned but without further ado let us get started. So I'll start with the super popular one. A lot of people are talking about it right now. There's been a lot of hype surrounding it but it is Ace of Shades by Amanda Foodie and I'm actually about halfway through it already and absolutely loving it. The book follows N. Salta, whose mother recently went missing, so she travels to the City of Sins in order to try to find her mother. There, she meets a con artist street lord named Levi. He offers to help N in the exchange for 10,000 volts in order to get out of a investment deal that he is in with a prima donna of a mafia family. N uncovers something that she didn't know about herself, and Levi gets into a little bit of trouble with the other mafia family and he has entered into the shadow game which is basically a game where nobody comes out alive and N needs to decide whether or not she is going to play in order to find her mother and free Levi or not. It's so good so far. The next book that I am anticipating is called Then She Was Gone and this is by Lisa Jewell and it is supposed to be releasing April 17th 2018. It follows a woman named Laurel Mack whose daughter actually went missing 10 years ago and then she meets a man named Floyd in a cafe and they begin a relationship. When Laurel meets Floyd's youngest daughter, Poppy, she realizes that she is a little bit familiar and she begins to question everything about her daughter's disappearance. I just think that it sounds so creepy because like, what if Poppy is Ellie? Like that would be crazy. Like what would you even do in that situation if like you literally found your missing daughter with the man who you're in a relationship with? Like, <laughs> The next book I have is called The Window and this is by Amelia Brunskill and it's supposed to be released April 3rd 2018. The book follows Anna and Jess who are identical twins but they are very very different but they still tell each other everything or at least Jess thought. One night while sneaking out Anna falls from her bedroom window and ends up dying. That's when Jess realizes that she was actually going to meet somebody so she wants to know who her sister was going to meet and what secrets she was actually hiding from her. I just want to know what the secrets are. Who was she gonna go meet? Was it like some killer? or like a boyfriend or like what's going on? I want to know. Also Dylan the Reader 5 read this book and said it was like amazing so I need it. The fourth book that I'm very excited about is called I've Got My Eyes on You and this is by Mary Higson Clark and it is also supposed to be released on April 3rd 2018. It follows 18 year old Carrie Downing who was found at the bottom of her family's swimming pool after hosting a party while her parents were away. Two suspects have been put forth. One her boyfriend who was seen arguing with her at the party and two her 22 year old neighbor who was very upset that he wasn't actually invited to the party. There's also the possibility of anybody else but the police don't know who it could be. Carrie's older sister Aline decides that she is going to help the prosecuting officer figure out who might have murdered her sister and that's when she realizes that she might actually be putting her own life in danger. I just want to know what happens. Like, who killed Carrie? Who killed Carrie? And the final book that I'm anticipating is called What She Doesn't Know and this is by Andrew E. Kaufman. It follows a woman named Riley Harper who nearly a decade ago was locked up into a psychiatric unit because she was the suspect of a murder investigation. Now, a couple years later, she is being released and she just wants to start a new life in a normal way. That's not gonna happen because she meets her neighbor named Samantha Light and quickly becomes obsessed with her and things escalate from there. I just think it sounds so cool and I just wanna know what the heck is up with Riley and like, what's this obsession? Like, is she gonna go crazy again and she like freak out and like kill Samantha? We don't know unless we read the book, so I need the book. All right guys, so those were a couple of my most anticipated reads for April 2018. Let me know down below what you guys are anticipating and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!